Well, the butterscotch and cinnamon pie is finally ready. Another job well done, don't you think? It smells really good. So, when do we get to eat some? We will have some later, my child. We just need to wait for it to cool down first. So, what do you think? Did I do a good job? Yeah, I say you have. Your butterscotch and cinnamon pies are the best. Thank you so much. Now, come along, let's go into the sitting room and wait for the pie to cool down, and then we can have some. Howdy. Am I speaking to a Mr. Swanson? Listen here my good sir, I have a rather important question that I need to ask you. Is your nose running by any chance? It is? Well, you better get off your ass and go catch it. Ha 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 ha, you really are an idiot, lol, gotti. Don't tell me that you're making prank calls to poor old Mr. Swanson again. Maybe I am, maybe I'm not, who knows, it's a mystery. Besides, even if I was, what are you going to do about it? For goodness sake, can't you leave that poor man alone? Stop bothering him. Okay okay, I'll just go elsewhere and do other things, see you idiots later. Zoom. My god! He can be such a pain in the behind sometimes. But anyway, how was your first day at school today? Well, it wasn't too bad. Millie got the baked bean stuck up her nose during lunch, and she had to go to the nurse's office to get it out. Oh dear. That poor girl, did they manage to get it out? Yeah, even though it took about half an hour, but they managed to get it out eventually. Tee hee hee hee, you know. I think she should have left it up there, and maybe she would have had a bin stalk growing out of her nose, oh my life, that would have been so hilarious. Actually dum dum, bean stalks don't grow from baked beans, only regular beans. Did you just call me dum dum, oh my, my feelings are hurt, ouch, that hurt my non-existing soul. Just go away and stop listening in on our conversation. Wow. Rude. Well. Okay then, I will go, but, I always come back. Anyway, shall we go and see if the pie has cooled down yet? Yeah okay, it's been sitting in the kitchen long enough now, so hopefully, it should be cooled down. Great. Let's go then. Oh my god, the pie, it's gone. Oh no. It can't be, I'm sure that I left it right here. What do you think could have happened to it? Well, I reckon that it's been stolen and hidden, either that or someone in the house has eaten it, because our pie just does not disappear like that. Well, I think it's time that we have a house meeting. Frisk, go and gather up everyone. Okay, but I have a question, where exactly are we having the house meeting? We shall have it in the sitting room, tell everyone to come there at once, we must find out what happened to the missing pie. Okay, off I go. I. Am. Furious. Ha 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 look at you, you big cry baby. Ha 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 ha. You look so stupid crying and flexing your python arms like that. You are hot one. Oh. Why thank you very much for the compliment. Hey. And what do you want small child? I've come to tell you that we're having a house meeting and I was told to round up everyone and tell them to go to the sitting room. Does that include little old me? Well, obviously. Oh, but I don't want to, I want to stay out here and be rude to random people walking by. Oh look, is that a troll I see? Oh wait, it's just Karen, it's so hard to tell the difference. Oh stop being a pain in the bum and go to the sitting room right now. Bruh. Fine then, seeing as you're obviously going to force me. Sands. I swear to God if you play that Scabidi toilet video one more time, I will throw that PC out of the window on a rocket launcher. Sans and Papyrus, you both need to go to the sitting room right now. Nay, nah, eh? If it isn't our little human friend. What's going on kid? Why do we need to go to the sitting room? Well it's kind of a long story, but it all will be explained in the meeting. Well, okay, let's get going then. We're right behind you, bro. Now then, I guess you're, you're wondering why I asked everyone to come here into the sitting room. Well, I will tell you all. I baked a butterscotch and cinnamon pie earlier today and now it has mysteriously disappeared. 
Now, all I want is for the person responsible to own up. Well, I know that it wasn't me. I just don't get it. Who in their right mind would want to steal a pie? That is so uh, ooh, ooh, not fabulous at all. Maybe there is a serial pie thief on the loose. Maybe they are going into people's houses and stealing pies, and I bet they are really fat because they ate them all. You know, you're acting rather swiss. Did you have something to do with this you troublesome weed? What the? Oh man, I feel so insulted. Did you honestly think that little old me could do something so diabolical as stealing a pie? Oh, you just hurt my non-existing soul. Well, you have been playing pranks all day, now, are you sure that you didn't hide the pie as part of your little prank tirade? Let me think, maybe I did, maybe I didn't, we may never find out the truth. I may have but maybe I don't want to tell. Hey! Just own up God damn it. You clearly stated that you were responsible so just admit it before I bring out the lawnmower. Okay okay fine, it was me, I hid the pie. However, I am not going to say where exactly I hid it, so, ha ha take that. Do you want to go for time out in the naughty vase again? Oh god no. Not the dreaded naughty vase. Well, tell us where the pie is then. Okay, 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 okay. It's in the kitchen cupboard. Now can you possibly reconsider making me go for time out in the naughty vase? Well, now that we all know who was behind the disappearance of the pie, you are you're free to go. Except for you, Flurry. You can stay behind and explain yourself. Well, I'm going to stay behind, because I am nosy and want to know why he hid the pie also. Flurry, on the couch, right now. Okay bossy boos. So, why did you hide the pie anyway? Oh, I was just bored that's all, no real reason, and I didn't eat any of it, the whole thing is still there. So please, do not punish me, it was just a harmless little pranky poo. Unlike the time I stole all the human souls and hung that entitled Karen over a pit of lava. Wow. Oh dear, what's the matter? Doesn't the entitled Karen want to go swimming in the lava? Ha 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 ha, he he he, that was so funny. Alright calm down Flurry, I'm not going to punish you, after all, you did own up in the end, and that was the right thing to do. Yeah, she's right, you did the right thing by owning up in the end. Well thank the idiots, now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going into the garden to get some fresh air. Well now that's over with, shall we go and have some of that pie as it will most likely be cooled down now. Yeah, okay. <laughs>